want to make some acknowledgements of some new sponsors we have this year. So. Good evening, and thank you so much for being here. My name is Clarence Padilla, and it's my privilege to conduct this wonderful band. This band's made up of professionals from all over central Iowa. It's people that play in the Des Moines Symphony, people that pay, play in Orchestra Iowa, play for Broadway shows um, at the Civic Center, and uh, teach at, at all of the major universities uh, here in central Iowa. So again, we are so glad that you are here. We, have a wonderful concert for you. Our theme tonight is called Sounds of the Summer, so uh, hopefully we will uh, meet all of your expectations about uh, tunes from the summer. Our first selection tonight is a uh, uh, to celebrate an Iowa composer by the name of Tracy Rush. She is a teacher and composer who lives in Dubuque, Iowa, and we are uh, pleased to, to play a selection of hers entitled Spirit of Freedom.
Thank you so much. How do we look? If you like the way you look, let me know, because it was my idea. <laughs> but uh, I had the uh, honor of playing with the Long Beach Municipal Band for about uh, 20 years in Long Beach, California, before I moved to Iowa. And uh, so I got the idea from them. And uh, for a long time, this band wore white pants, or white shirts and black pants, but I thought I'd try and change it, only because I have a lot of these kinds of shirts. So <laughs> I hope you like it. Our next selection uh, is called The Blues, and so uh, we hope you like all of the selections from this particular medley. It's a fun, fun uh, selection for us to play, and uh, we are just about ready to start.
This is my friend Dwayne, right up there. Thank you so much. What a beautiful evening, isn't it? Great evening. I hope it stays just like this. Well, we're going to play something just a little softer and a little slower for you. This is a piece by David Holsinger, who is a, uh, a noted uh, band composer. Um, and about 10 years ago, he wrote a piece entitled On a Hymn Song of Philip Bliss. And this is based on the uh, uh, hymn, It Is Well With My Soul. Hope you like it.
a nice hand for Dan Peichel on French horn. If I could have you think back to the last tune, how about a nice hand for Aaron Williams over here on the drum set, too. Well, it's Father's Day. Uh, raise your hand if you are a father here in the audience or in the band. Well, congratulations. Happy Father's Day to you. How about a big hand for all the fathers? So this next tune is for you. This is a medley of someone uh, that I cherish and love to listen to. Um, music of Frank Sinatra.
as Dan said, we're changing the format just a little bit. We're going to play about 45 minutes, 50 minutes of concert band music. We'll take a little break, hopefully and get something to eat downstairs, and then we'll do about 25 minutes of big band music. Uh, next week, we are uh, privileged to have Fred Gazzo join us with the big band, Des Moines' own. Des Moines own. And two weeks after that, I believe on July 8th, we will have Max Wellman joining the big band. So hopefully you can come out for that. This is the first of four concerts by this uh, particular organization. And then there'll be two more concerts um, in July for the Music of the Stars. So there'll be six concerts in total. Every week, we're going to feature one of our musicians. And this week, we're starting with the bottom up. So if you can see Mike over here. Uh, this week we are featuring Mike Short on tuba as our tuba soloist. Thanks, Mom. Mike is an Iowa native, born in Fort Dodge, Iowa, and uh, uh, went to school at UNI and, and spent some time playing professionally in Chicago. He uh, has played with the Des Moines Symphony, he's played with the Orchestra Iowa, he plays a lot of the Broadway shows uh, that come to comes to town, and he's been just a great friend and colleague over at Drake University for the last, uh, oh gosh, 20 years or so. So uh, uh, Mike is going to play this afternoon a piece by Claude T. Smith. It is called, yes, that's right, it's a piece by James Kerno. <laughs> Next week is Claude T. Smith. James Kerno entitled Concertino for Tuba and Band. Thank you. 
Thanks, Mike. In our community, there are many hundreds of families who cannot afford to have their children play in band. Thank you, Dan. Well, as you can imagine, it's, uh, it's always a challenge playing outside for a, a group of 50 people and uh, with the wind and everything else and the heat, but we're doing a fine job. What do you think?
One of the things we're, we're uh, uh, considering is whether or not we should move the band around, leave it in this location, or, or move it perhaps either facing to my right or to the south, or possibly facing to my left or to the north. So I'm going to just take a very, very unscientific poll. And you'll have three choices here. Either stay where we are, face to my right, or face to my left, or go to the, and, and go to the north. So if you've had about 10 seconds to think about that, by applause, let me know if you'd like for the band to stay right where it is. How many would like the band to turn around? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> How many would like uh, the band to face to the south, to this grassy area, to my right? <laughs> okay, and uh, how many would like the band to face to the north or my left? Okay, that's pretty obvious. <laughs> we'll stay right here and, and uh, we'll enjoy the fountain. We have a couple more pieces to play for you uh, with the concert band setting and then we'll break, take a little break and go to the big band. Uh, we'd like to uh, uh, play a selection of jazz standards uh, featuring A Night in Tunisia, St. Louis Blues, It Don't Mean a Thing, If It Ain't Got That Swing, and then it'll close with Birdland.
thank you so much. And a concert out at the Capitol on a beautiful summer evening would not be sufficient unless we played a Sousa March. So here it is for you. This is called the the Liberty Bell. Thank you so much. We're going to take about a 10 minute break. All right, we are back with the Des Moines Metro Big Band. So I hope you like jazz. We feature a lot of our uh, terrific soloists. I'm going to start out with a very important tune as far as I was concerned by Steve Allen called The Start of Something Big.
tenor saxophone, Paul Brightson, trombone, Jim Bobinette on trumpet, and Mr. Bruce Martin on piano. Give him a big hand. <laughs> Do you know Steve Allen went to Drake University for a year? Anyone remember what year? I googled it this afternoon. 1941. And then he went over to Arizona State, which was called Arizona State College, in 1942. So, Steve Allen graced the halls of Drake, 1941. We're going to change styles just a little bit, go with a light samba. This is an original composition from Andy Klassen, who uh, teaches jazz and trumpet, a colleague of mine over at Drake. He's down at the Civic Center right now playing Billy Elliot, but he'll be here next week. And this is uh, called It's All Good.
It's called It's All Good by uh, Andy Klassen, featuring Bill Bergeron on trumpet. And yeah, good hand for Bill. And Mr. Wayne Page on tenor saxophone. play something from the Woody Herman Library. This is called Things Ain't What They Used to Be. Thank you. 
Candy on trombone. Wayne Page again on tenor saxophone. Jim Bobinet on trumpet. And how about that incredible clarinet playing? John Morgan. I gave him four lessons. <laughs> We're going to head over to the Count Basie Library. Uh, composition by Frank Foster, slow it down just a little bit, entitled Shiny Stocking.
Count Basie Orchestra featuring Professor Bob Wiest on trumpet. And professor, English professor from Drake, Bruce Martin on keyboard. All right, thank you so much for coming. We're going to close with one more tune from uh, Jerome Kern and Oscar Hammerstein entitled All the Things You Are. step in front of my camera. Could you go straight down? Thank you. Everybody bring four friends next.